how to add progress bars onto ClickUp. So you want to add a progress bar. Usually it'll appear right around on this right hand side corner, but you need to add it from the settings. So let's get right into it. ClickUp can be a little finicky sometimes, but once you get a hang of the UI, you'll be able to add more than a progress bar after this tutorial. So first off, we want to press on this customize button with the little gear, customize. And then till it'll come up with a lot of options here, but the one you want to pay attention to is just this fields. Fields. And here you'll see a lot of options you can do, but if you search through these, progress won't be uh, here. So you'll need to search. Let's just search up progress. Now there'll be a new field, it'll be called there's AI progress, there's auto, and there's manual. You can use auto if you want, but I prefer using the manual one. So let's try that. And this will be called, well, progress. You can name it something else if you want. The description will be a bar for our progress on the work. And it'll be type manual. You can change the type here as well. You can set the start value and the end value as well. So maybe you want to make all the make all the start value be at starting at 20% or something along those lines. But um, I won't mess with this value for this tutorial. I'll create. See, see what I mean? It can be a little finicky sometimes, but that's okay. Let's try that again. There you go. You can also add from this, add a column around here, but sometimes you can add it from customize or you can add it from this uh, plus thing over here. But once you've added this, now you can mess around with it. See, I can track it around. Maybe this task one I'm doing is around 50% done. The task two is around only 31% done and task three is 100% done. So that is how you add progress bar onto ClickUp. It's as easy as that.